we're going for action with the Via Speaker label and not so much like just a shoe picture but a picture that your eye will go to the shoe but it's kind of more a fashion picture, a vogue picture so to speak and a full length. We felt we had come up with such a beautiful collection, a very bold, very graphic, very sort of, you know, traffic stopping product. And we really loved the idea of just sort of creating an ad campaign which is about that. It's about this woman and she feels so very bold, very confident, very sexy, very alive. And people are just suddenly sort of in awe of that and it basically stops traffic. Well, my character doesn't realize I'm stopping traffic. <laughs> she just is. <laughs> One, two, three, go. It was very cinematic. I think that was the main thing we were trying to create here. It wasn't something static. It had like a moment in time. It was like very European style, but there was also a very New York moment in it. And there's the girl from beautiful, totally middle American blonde and Italian shoes. So I did uh, pretty much a slick top, but left a bit of wave everywhere and treated it lightly up and down, depending on uh, the total look of the clothes. Maybe my first job with Chris John was in, I think, 1972. So it's like having certain musicians where you don't have to kind of say, could you make the rhythm like this? Could you do this? They kind of already know and you trust each other. So I think really the choice with Arthur Elgort, we loved the way he brings this sort of editorial and femininity and flair together into his work. It's very urban, it's very modern, and they capture the woman living her life in the city. Oh, well, there were some typical scenarios where we wanted the idea that a man may notice the girl, so when you saw the guy sitting in the cafe and she walked by. Also, that was a little bit of the uh, Italian kind of thing. Maybe it came from that old picture of the girl walking down the street and the men giving it a look. And the whole team's nice and everybody knows each other, so it's great. It's real friendly and real laid back and relaxed and that makes the shoot real. It makes it nice. Sometimes the shoe is what completes the outfit, now we're starting in reverse. So it's all starting from the shoe and the outfit follows from there. So we thought obviously we want to draw attention to the shoe, so legs were really, really important and Michelle has endless legs so that helped a lot. You're going to jump in that space? Yeah, she's going to hop, basically hop before. Oh, okay. So it's just really one jump. Oh, okay. Here we go. They are very comfortable. And on Monday when we did the fitting, that's the first thing I was stoked about. I was like, wow, they're going to be comfortable for jumping around for two days, yes. So that makes the days a piece of cake. <laughs> All of the pictures, there was some sense of, let's call it a fashion action picture. Nobody was just like going, holding their shoe, like by sticking it on a step or something like that. Well, you get to see that it's a lot of fake steps, like, back and forth for about an hour, like step here, backwards, step here, backwards, step here. <laughs> no, you, yeah, well, make a big jump. Here.